Hello friends, today I'll show you how you can draw a traverse using SWDTM. For this, first open AutoCAD, type UN command. So make sure that uh, the unit is decimal here and the insertion scale is millimeters. Click OK. After that, open SWDTM. Uh, before using this software, you have to enter all your data in Excel in this format. All right. So first column should have serial number, second column should have X coordinate, third column should have Y coordinate, fourth column should have G coordinate, and fifth column should have Remax. Here, CP1 and CP2 represent control point 1 and control point 2. Similarly, 10M1, 10M2, 10M3 represent the points in the major traverse, while 10M1, 10M2, 10M3, these points represent the points in the minor traverse. Okay, so uh, after you have done all these things, uh, what you do next is that select all those points which you want to plot in AutoCAD. Okay, so we select all the points like this, like this, and we open SWDTM, click on points import points from Excel so here you see that point level is scale right so if your area is very large you have to increase this value and if your area is very small you can decrease this value or keep it as it is so we have here major traverse so as it is very large what we do is that we increase this value to 3 and uh, don't check check this and click on import points and open AutoCAD Ah, you can see here that all the points have been plotted like CP1 uh, you can see here CP2 and 10M1 all the points have been plotted here and after that what we do next is that we join all these points using a line for this click on polyline here and uh, start from CP1 you can start however you like uh, it's your choice and uh, you have to join all the points like this alright so for using SWDTM software you need to have a little bit of knowledge of AutoCAD without this uh, you cannot do uh, your work in uh, using SWDTM because SWDTM basically uses AutoCAD so you need to have knowledge of basic knowledge you don't need thorough knowledge you just need a uh, basic knowledge of AutoCAD alright so how you can pan here or how you use polyline know how you draw lines you need to know all those things okay so we do these we connect all the points here alright alright so okay so once we have drawn uh, joined all the points click enter to escape polyline huh so we have uh, made our traverse here as you can see it's a uh, is the traverse we have drawn the traverse so next thing we do is that we uh, insert grid lines here in order to uh, know the coordinate points for example if we, are, we don't know the coordinate of this point right here it says 10 m6 but we don't know what the coordinate of this point is okay so for this we have to insert a grid but in order to do that we open SWDTM here and click on draw draw grid and draw grid with grid lines right so uh, where is it okay here is it okay so inter grid interval so what interval you want you can keep it as it is or you can change it click ok and uh, next is inter text height so what the height of the text you want uh, you can uh, we have uh, made three earlier so we can make three here also so click ok and and after that so let's minimize this one okay so why all right so all right so you have to select the first point of the grid line you want so I'll select it here then we have to select the top point of uh, the last grid line all right so I'll select it uh, somewhere here uh, now you can see here we have got a uh, grid lines and we have got a traverse plotted okay so now you can print this uh, drawing on uh, on any paper size on any desired scale so first let me tell you that uh, AutoCAD no no SWDTM plots uh, plots the coordinate points in one is to thousand scale it means that so from here to here 
so from 10 uh, m1 to 10 m2 so this distance if from here all right so from 10 m1 to 10 m2 if this is 1 meter in autocad it means that it is 1000 meter in actual field okay so this this is the meaning of 1 is to 1000 scale so if you have to print uh, this drawing in 1 is to 1000 scale as SWDTM has already plotted it in 1 is to 1000 scale you have to print it in 1 is to 1 scale so if you have to print it in 1 is to 500 scale so print this uh, drawing in 2 is to 1 scale okay so does that make sense <laughs> I don't know but uh, this is how it works you see uh, the AutoCAD this uh, SWDTM already has uh, plotted your points in 1 is to 1000 scale so you have to adjust using your own logic alright so that was for uh, this video I hope you understand it if you like it uh, click on like and subscribe for some more awesome videos thank you